Hey folks, as you can see by the thumbnail, uh, Goodwill this week had $2 clothes. All clo baby clothes, uh, men's clothes, women's clothes, kids clothes, $2. And um, I know there's a glut of clothes, but really at 2 bucks, and I tell you, I noticed I stopped at two locations and I noticed the place was busy. And uh, I still think I found some good stuff. I mean, if you could find Levi jeans for two dollars and jackets and stuff, and I and I left obviously, I wasn't going in there with the attitude of <laughs> buying a whole boatload of stuff. But let me get into it and show you what I got. It won't be a long video. Basically, it's just a thrift haul. I was excited about the two dollars at the end of the day, and uh, you know what? Uh, paying two dollars. Even if you're selling this stuff for uh, $10, $15, you could still make money, you know, plus shipping. Uh, I, 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 th three times my money, four times my money is still uh, good. And I'll show you some of the stuff that I got. And uh, again, give me thumbs up and I hope you like this. So let's get into it. Okay, oh, we just landed, <laughs> flew in. Uh, man, it's cold here in Pennsylvania. So I did pick up this, uh, these um, Wrangler jean shorts, two bucks. This Wilson light jacket, two bucks. And what I'll try to do is post some comps. I even got some stuff. I even think I picked up, I might have even picked up a pair or two. Uh, of something for my son. Yeah, I, I even maybe... Look at these. Carhartt. Carhartt shorts. $2. Um, actually, I'm gonna, I might keep these for myself. For $2. I mean, Carhartt is a good quality name. If I had to buy these brand new, they would be about $25, $30. So I actually think I'm going to keep these ones. I think I got two pair. I, I, I've been kind of busy all week with sourcing and doing shipping. But another pair of Carhartt, and um, you know, I inspect the pockets, make sure they're clean. Uh, deep pocket Carhartt's a good brand. I like the deep pockets. Good button shorts, and yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna. Is this my size? Yeah, I got them a little bit bigger, but um, I like you know. I picked up again a pair of Levi jeans, two bucks. Good shape jeans. At the end of the day, I get seven, eight dollars for those. I found these. Would I wear them? No, but they're called refill. Look at the uniqueness of the jeans. They're distressed there, and uh, obviously, not something. I probably should be able to. Maybe, maybe I get twelve, fifteen dollars uh, for these for these jeans. So I usually think I can make three or four times my money on on the stuff I got. A black pair of Levi jeans. Um, I even picked up these. Uh, $1.99. These uh, milk glass plates with cups. So while I was there, I bought those. I think I comped these out at around $15. I'll, I'll put up... Uh, where is it? Yeah, right there. Um, this t-shirt, 2 bucks. What's it say? Cool story, bro. I don't know. This one. This one was unique. 50th anniversary. The happiest celebration on earth. 50th. This is a 3XL. An official Walt Disney uh, tag there. So honestly, I, I that, that to me is a uh, probably a $20 shirt. Looks like they wore it once when they were down there, and then it got donated, you know? Um, this little jacket, little kid's jacket, two bucks. I had gotten two of those. Those were two dollars. Um, dollar ninety-nine. I'm like, oh, that's good. So I'll, I'll get those. Let me put these over here so I don't break them. Um... 
Oh, got the hanger with this one. This nice shirt, two bucks. This is a classic shirt. Hey, it's a nice shirt for two bucks. I mean, again, I could even if I sell that for seven ninety nine plus four dollars shipping, that's all right. Not every time, everything's going to be a home run all the time, guys. And um, sometimes you got to be willing to take some calculated risk and at the right price. Um, fat dog t-shirt it's called P-H-A-T dog nice unique design pair of Lee jeans two bucks actually found this and that's another thing I stopped for the two dollars and I found this laser pro putt returner $3.99 and I think when I comped it at the store, I think it's a like $30, $35 item. Okay. I got more. More here. Give me a second. Vans Warp Tour. Presented by Journeys. Looks like, like I said, it was brand. A lot of the stuff that I get too, I'm picky. This sweatshirt, it's and this sweatshirt's heavy. Look at this. This is Stephen Barry's hot rod embroidered sweatshirt. Two bucks. Pair of um, Orvis dress pants. Cargo, a lot, a lot of, it's amazing. A lot of this, I mean, it looks like it's it's never worn or worn once. A pair of jeans. These were called Mark Buchan uh, Authentic Pally 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 jeans or something like that. Men's jeans. Another pair of men's jeans, Carhartt, again, Carhartt, which is a good name. Carhartt is a good quality name. Um, this, I don't know what this, this is called Rosini. But it's a, it's it sort of reminds me of like it's funny it reminds me of like a barber shirt because of the pockets here. So I wonder if that's what it is. Two bucks. This T-shirt. The prom. Two bucks. I actually been holding off a couple days with this stuff. Look at this design. Nice white, yellow, Hawaiian shirt. I love Hawaiian shirts. But this is a sunny open in Hawaii. It's a size small. Um, it's a, it seems more like a medium, honestly. It's pretty roomy. But uh, really nice. G.E. Schmidt Workwear. Nice shirt. I mean... If you look, and he, I think you could tell by the camera, this is not... I don't buy stuff that's beat up around the collar or really stuff that you can get from Walmart. Um, honestly, if the price is going to be so close to Walmart, why buy... You know, I'm not I'm not going to spend uh, $7 on something that Walmart you can get for $8 or $10 or, you know, no. Nice, nice shirt. This is a Van Heusen classic fit. This, this, um, Capel, um, art from Bali. All right, I'm filming. Um, fish shirt. These, uh, Wrangler shorts. And these are a big, these are a pretty big size. Um, 48 waist. 
And that's why I picked them up. Because sometimes bigger guys um, have a hard time. I'm oh, I'm a 2X. But I, I know, try to look for 3X, 4X, 5X at Walmart. And you can't. You have to go to those specialty stores. Uh, I got a couple more in the bag here. This is a nice uh, Kavula, Kulavula, something like that, bay. A Hawaiian polo pullover. I liked it. And actually, oh, oh, I messed up on that one. See what I did, guys? Right there. I just saw it. I never saw it. Oh, well. There goes $2 down the drain. See that? There's a hole in it. I never noticed it. You know why? Because it was dark. I liked it because it was dark. And this way, if someone is not, you know, good at eating. But um, see that? There's a hole right there. I never noticed it. I'm going to try. Look, I don't want the money. But when I go back to Goodwill, I'll ask them. I'll say, hey, look, when I bought the shirts last time, you know I come in here all the time. And I, I, I do a uh, There was a hole I never noticed. Could, could we just swap it? And I'm pretty sure that they'll do that. Actually, what happened was when I got my receipt, they charged me for 20 shirts. And I was too busy talking to the lady in line. And I was bantering. And I knew it seemed kind of high. And when I got home, there was only 18. So I got overcharged. Here's a pair of, um, look at these, uh, ladies like pajama pants. And one more. It's a Halloween. You know, people who love Halloween. So that was the $2 haul that I got. Actually, that was a, over a course of two days. I have so many piles out here right now that uh, it's hard to kind of keep track. I'm like, okay, yeah, I picked that up that day. And, um, oh, maybe, no, I have another pile, but I got the, I paid regular price for that stuff. So I did a lot of sourcing this week. I was actually pretty busy, uh, with Amazon. eBay is so-so. Um, Amazon is so-so too. It's not real busy, but I actually got a lot of returns back from Amazon, stuff that was sitting in the warehouse. So... All right, guys, I hope you liked this video. I just wanted to show you the stuff that I did get for two bucks, uh, clothing, and I showed you those two um, plates. Heck, I put out, honestly, less than $100, and the putter and the plates alone w w will basically, so ba I sell them, that pays for everything, and uh, I haven't given up on clothing. I like I like a lot of clothing. Stuff that basically you don't buy at Walmart and uh, stuff that is good that people donate that they haven't worn. Um, I mean, a lot of times I even find stuff uh, new and I like that it's light, it's easy to ship. It's light, folded up, and uh, the price point is, I know it's cheap, you know, um, but uh, hopefully that price point uh, makes it that it sells. So... I got more videos to record. I'm not going to do that today because I did basically pretty much three hauls today. Went to a new Goodwill and um, when I was down in Harrisburg, Pennsylvania about a week ago and found a lot of great stuff. So one thing I've been doing is when I'm doing this is when you guys check out my eBay store, the stuff that I showed you is already listed. So before sometimes it'd be like show you the stuff and then Put it in a pile and then kind of forget about it. And two months go by, I still don't have it listed, which doesn't make sense. I'm a reseller. Let's get the stuff listed. And maybe one of you guys that are watching like the item and, and want to go in my store and support the channel and support me and, and buy the stuff. So, all right, guys. Thanks for watching. Have a great week or weekend wherever you're at. Bye.